Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. On Windows 10 and Windows 11, Microsoft Defender, as you may well know, is the built-in antivirus that's bundled in both operating systems by default. Now, if you are using Microsoft Defender like I am, which is part of the Windows Security app, um, I use it on both Windows 10 and Windows 11, as you may well know, it does provide real-time protection for malware such as things like ransomware, viruses, spyware, just to mention a couple of examples. Now, it also offers an option to scan files and folders manually, which can be quite handy if you have downloaded maybe a file or an image or something from the internet that maybe looks suspicious or you just want to test it to make double sure. And you don't want to perform a whole system scan, which can take quite a while, or even a quick scan can take a good couple of minutes. And what we would do is, if I just head into my file explorer quickly, into my downloads, I'm just using this image as an example. So maybe I've downloaded this and I just want to check it just to make sure that there is no viruses or malware attached and I don't want to run a full scan or a quick scan as mentioned. I would right click, and on Windows 11, you would have to click on Show More Options. And here you'll see Scan with Microsoft Defender. Now on Windows 10, it's a very similar process. You would right click, but this is the first menu you will see on Windows 10. On Windows 10, there is no modern menu. So Windows 11, you click on Show More Options. Windows 10, jump straight to this menu. And you'll see scan with Microsoft Defender and what you would do is you would just click on that and of course that's just one file so it'll be very quick. Once you've completed the steps the Windows Security app as we can see will open on the virus and threat protection page and you can view the scan result and any other information if it is provided. So here you can see today's date, the time and zero threats were found in this case and then if there is a threat that's found, then obviously you would be able to deal with it accordingly through Microsoft Defender. So I'm just letting you know in case you're unaware. And that's just a nice, simple, easy way. If you just want to just scan a single individual file or folder without having to perform a full system scan or even a quick scan using Microsoft Defender. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.